What's up, YouTube? This your girl, Off the Lee, and I'm back with another video, and I'm back in fully fed, as you guys see by the title. Um, we have a video about Vibes Cartel, bro, and it's a sad video, and yeah, bro, like, bro, what? Free my dude vibes. I just don't know what to say. I don't know. I'm finna watch this. I don't know. Should I watch that or should I watch? Oh, okay, no, that's 39 minutes long. I'm finna watch this first video. I guess it was on the news or something. But dang, it say Vibes Cartel has life threatening illness remains in prison. Free my boy. Somebody free vibes, bro. Free vibe. Free vibes. Get him the help. Cause this is about to piss me off for real like for real like this is not right at all we're gonna get into it bring this not right drinking water to your school not that we're a boss okay we'll show you how now to a story that you'll only see on fox 5 new concerns over the health and well-being of vibes cartel not the rural Start boss bro the king of dance hall is an bro just gonna get me covering like this new stuff can i react to this ailing health fox 5's lisa ever spoke to his attorney and his family today lisa what you're hearing is not good what's the deal no it is not steven natasha's international <laughs> music superstar vibes this cartel is. continues his fight for freedom in the courts he's facing an got my heart broke bro his health and very survival i obtained a sworn medical affidavit where his private doctor notified authorities that his graves disease and heart condition are getting worse and that if he does not get surgery soon he could die Mr. Palmer's illness is actually life-threatening. Adija Palmer is known to millions of fans around the world as no. entertainer Vibes Cartel. For the last week, he's been in solitary lockdown 23 hours. Solitary lockdown. So he's been locked down, you know, on his own. Ain't no telling where. What's the living conditions and where he at, bro? Like, I don't know, but. Bro, he been locked up how long? About a long time. It's been a long, long time, bro. They need to do something about this. It was a day over an alleged cell phone infraction. He's in a cell, and if you can pitch up a brick oven, because that's how those cells are built. This a brick oven, bro. He in a cell by himself, like, bricked up. Like, not like, but what he say? Built. This in, the ventilation is next to none. The man widely considered to be the king of dancehall music has he been is the king. bars in Jamaica since 2011. On a 2011, bro. It's 2020 fucking three. Free my boy. He didn't serve his time. Get him out of there. Yeah, they tripping. Why is he still in there? Why? Murder conviction. It's a crime he insists he did not commit and is appealing the conviction to the UK's highest court. They don't him dirty, bro. Down conditions, being in a brick cell with no air circulation, no, no air, and a bucket for a to No air circulation, no water, and a bucket for a toilet. Like, look at that. Look. That is the worst. My boy still fresh. Oh, look at him. Got the J's on. Hold on. Vibes was fresh. But the environment, come on. They got to do better. Toilet are making his health worse, says his attorney. He's been in there for so long. Yes, his health going to get worse with no air. His face, his face is actually, his face is actually swole. Swole. And say, um, one of the thing is he always wear glasses because the, the condition that he has caused his eyes to, um, Protrude. The medical report we obtained exclusively was done two months ago by Cartel's well respected private physician, Dr. Karen Phillips. It details his seven year history battling Graves' disease, a thyroid condition. Hey, so, the hey, report man. says despite medication, it has not gone into remission. He also suffers from two heart conditions and complications. Dang. Dr. Phillips recommended surgery as soon as possible. I did not so know he was going through all yes, this, bro. It can be dangerous. 
we do not want to get a phone call to say because he, he was cannot. under this 20 yes. this 23 hour lockdown and unable to breathe he cannot um, go out like that in there bro he cannot his, uh, go out in there i spoke exclusively with vibes That's cartel's his son, son and yeah. jaheem palmer known as little vibes Ooh, for the, the family the son he says they are keeping the faith that his father will get better it weighs on my heart very heavy and i think about it a lot but Honestly, we just have to stay strong and just know that he's doing the best he can as well because he also has a strong mindset. So at the end of the day, we just pray to God pray. and keep strong at all times. So that's the best way to look at, to go about it. Pray for vibes, y'all, man. Lickle Vibes says he and his family thank all the fans who are keeping his father in their prayers. Buchanan tells me he's contacted the prison superintendent who ordered the lockdown and has notified national law enforcement officials in Jamaica. I'm in direct contact with his team and should anything new develop about his condition, I will let you know. I reached out to prison officials, but we got no response. Back to you, Steve. All right, thanks, Lise. Oh man, free my boy Vaz, yo. Free that man. He did his time, bro. He didn't serve it. He needs to be free, bro. He needs to be healthy. They is not treating him right in there, bro. Locked up in a in a room just big as nothing. No air, no water. Barbella water. Bucket to pee and dookie in, bro. A bucket. Like they need to do better. They need to free him. We're a boss. He just pray. They have a positive mindset that he'd be okay. That something will pull through. And yay. That he get the help. He get the surgery. Cause it just don't make no sense, bro. We he cannot go out like that. He cannot. Not at all. He cannot. He just can't. It's ridiculous, bro. But like, comment, subscribe. Keep vibes in your prayers each and every day. Because, <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on with this world, bro. But yeah. like, comment, subscribe. Vibes. Stay strong, my boy. He going to be out soon. He going to be out soon, man. He... Catch you guys in my next video, bro.